the Chakti, as it's called, <coughs> um, is a rope, and each knot is braided 12 times, um, or tied in a way where there's 12 knots in each knot, I guess. Uh, before that, it was in, they were made of wooden beads or stone beads. And I'd always thought that the idea of um, prayers or meditations with beads came from India or <coughs> China and moved west. <coughs> but through looking into the issue, I was wrong. It actually started in the uh, the Christian tradition and moved either way. The rosary is very late. When I mean very late, it's from the 12th or 13th century. But I adore the rosary. We can say the rosary, we're just not allowed to say the mysteries. Um, but I think it's fantastic. Uh, there's a special place in my heart for the for the rosary, the western rosary, not just the eastern rosary. The eastern rosary just has simple prayer. The simplest form is Lord have mercy. Uh, the complex version is uh, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. But any variant of that works. Um, you know, I've heard Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy upon me. Uh, Lord Jesus Christ, Son of God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. Uh, Son of God, have mercy upon me, a sinner. But the easiest and most complete one is Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. But as for the rosary with the intervals of the Lord's Prayer and the Ave Maria or the Hail Mary as you know it, I think is absolutely beautiful. I love it. Um, the Way of the Pilgrim is a great book about uh, somebody's life with uh, prayer beads or prayer rope. And it's, uh, unfortunately, my prayer rope was destroyed. Um, I would recommend it to anybody. And it's it's not a very thick book. It's a beautiful book. It's called The Way of the Pilgrim. It's by an anonymous author. Uh, peace to you. And this is from a dear, dear friend. Um, somebody who defended me when I was unable to defend myself. Peace to you.